Calling from a 978 area code. Oh, geez. This is the final caller of the day. Oh, boy. I got to start doing a five-hour show. <laughs> Calling from a 978 area code. Now I know why all those streamers. That's why, like, Hassan does like, 18 hours a day or whatever he's doing. 978, who's this? Where are you calling from? 978? 978? Nine, nine, right, we may have to go with somebody else. You better get here quick. Hello, is this me? Yes, it's you. You made it. Hey, uh, this is Christian from Massachusetts. Christian from Massachusetts. Where in Massachusetts, Christian? Oh, you know, a little town, you know, Belrica, Massachusetts. Belrica! In Belrica. Okay. Yeah. What's on your mind? Uh, calling with a, a little bit of some good labor news in the past month or so. Um, not sure if you heard, the Woburn Teachers Association had a strike at the beginning of February. I don't think I did uh, hear the, that. The, uh, the, the Woburn? Yes. Okay. Uh, so it lasted at about for about five days. Uh, the strike was started because in 2021, uh, the was when the last contract was signed, and uh, they had a teachers got a total of a one percent increase, as I believe what the number was for their pay. And then going into this past school year, they actually had no contract signed, so they've been working for the first half of the school year with no guarantees. And the 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 city of Woburn basically just sat on their ass for the for, until the deadline came, where when the teachers were threatening a strike, and that time passed. So for the entire week, uh, from the I believe from the first to the fifth, uh, Woburn schools were just completely shut down all week, and it ultimately the strike did actually succeed. They the teachers were it's about 550 educators plus. Uh, and I don't know if the paraprofessionals are included in that, just as it's 550 members um, of the Women Teachers Association. Great. But ultimately, the, the strike was a success. The teachers are going to get it's a 13.5% raise over four years. Um, and the paraprofessionals, over the same time, they're actually getting a 40% raise, which while it is a kind of an astronomical number, the starting salary prior to that for a paraprofessional in Woburn was 22000 a year. Jeez, and people so should know that Woburn is like, um, is really Metro Boston at this point. I mean, it has been for a long time. It's within the 95 Beltway, right? Yeah, absolutely. For the most part, if I remember correctly. And yeah, there's a little bit that crosses over to like the north side of that, but it, it might as well be the whole thing. Yeah, and um, I, I don't know. I mean, I haven't been in that area in years, but I see what's happening in Worcester. So if it's if if uh, you know housing has gone up in Worcester, I imagine it's gone up in Woburn without a doubt. Uh, well, well, that's absolutely. good news. Like, I, I gotta I, go. I, mean, but I, I appreciate the I appreciate yeah. the call. Yeah, no problem. Thank you. Go Sox. All right, appreciate that. All right, folks, that is the end of our call-in portion of the program. Nathan Coyote says, Bob, we got to get a Fitchburg call in someday. Uh, sorry, I wish I could take more phone calls. Uh, 